Hello everyone, welcome back to another reaction video, and today I'll be doing a reaction to yes, a movie, Breaking Bad. Hmm, I guess we're doing a party of Breaking Bad then. And what, what, what is this, are we on quarantine again? Oh god. Hmm. Well, I wonder what's gonna happen in this one, since I haven't really seen Breaking Bad, so I wanna know what's gonna happen, so I'm in for a surprise. But anyway, make sure to go subscribe to some of the rest of the crew mentioned in the description below. Anyway, let's go. Happy, it's time to go to school. All right, Danny, just as soon as I get done eating my breakfast. Jeff, you're not going to eat blue rock candy for breakfast. Well, I'm 18, so I'm going to do it anyway. What, Jeff, you're 18 in the third grade? <laughs> Jeffy, stop it. It's not my fault my hopes are up and my syndrome is down. Marvin, look, the news. Stop it. That's my thing. Marvin, look, the news. <laughs> Better. candy is now illegal. Scientists have found that it causes early onset diabetes, schizophrenia, and teeth cancer. Blue rock candy is illegal? <laughs> Jeffy, don't eat that. It's super illegal and it's dangerous. Wait, no one knows that I have it. I'll just be taking this. What? The cops? Yeah, we're going around confiscating everybody's blue rock candy because this is super illegal now. And also, the street value of this is insane. You can get thousands of dollars just for this. Huh. You guys should have sold it before I got here. Well, what am I going to eat for breakfast now? <sighs> Jeffy, just eat your cat food. Marvin, don't give Jeffy cat food again. It's okay, Mommy. I like shrimp and biscuits. See, baby, he likes it. Yeah, eat it up, Jeffy. <sighs> Who's that? Hello? Good morning, Marvin. Lovely day, isn't it? Uh, yeah? I'm sure you're wondering why I'm here. Uh, I don't have my house payment this month. Oh, I know, but it's not my problem anymore because I sold your mortgage to the Mexican cartel. Hey, you say. Wait, you sold my mortgage? I sure did. And the bad news is that sometimes I would let you miss house payments without any consequences. But they love consequences. You want to know how I lost my eye and my hand? I missed my house payment, so I cut them off myself to teach myself a lesson. Wow. I'm going to let you guys talk. So where's my money, Bato? Uh, listen, I don't have the money this month. Listen, you better have my $10,000 by tomorrow morning, or else I'm going to take your ball sack, cut it off, and turn it into a balloon to give to my daughter on her quinceañera. My house payment's not $10,000. It is now, Bato, so you better get it, or else I'm going to mucho gracias your ball sack. It's a really nice house. You have a good day. Oh, no! Oh, my God! What's wrong, Marvin? Goodman sold my mortgage to the Mexican cartel, and they said if I don't give them $10,000 by tomorrow, they're going to mucho gracias my ball sack. What does that even mean? A lot thank you, his ball sack. Exactly. Marvin, where are we going to get that kind of money? I mean, I could sell my car. Yeah, that could work. Hey, Marvin, I got some bad news for you. Sorry, it looks like you're already having a bad day, but I'm going to make it worse. Your lung x-rays came back, and you see that black spot? That's lung cancer. Oh, my God! You have lung cancer. Is it bad? Oh, no, it's actually the good kind of lung cancer. It is? No, no, there's no such thing. It's all lung cancer and it's all bad. Well, what are we going to do? Well, we could treat it by tomorrow and you'd probably survive it, but the treatments are hundreds of thousands of dollars and I know you can't afford that. Well, what can you do for me? Well, I can give you this box of tissue so you can cry me a river, and I can give you this hammer so you can build a bridge and get over it. Marvin, what are we going to do? Well, I'm the one with the cancer and the payment, so I feel like I should be crying. Oh, yeah, you're right. Honestly, Danny, what I would do is, since they can't legally deny you medical care, is let your medical bills go to collections, and then you focus on making your mortgage payment. That's really smart, Jeffy. So, yeah, let, let's focus on making $10,000 by tomorrow. Anyone have any ideas to make money? Well, the police officer man said that the blue rock candy's worth thousands of dollars. But, Jeffy, that's illegal. Yeah, Jeffy, that's illegal, and you wouldn't happen to have any more of that candy sitting around, would you? No, that was my last little bit. Damn it. Marvin, you weren't thinking about something selling that, were you? I mean, it's worth thousands of dollars. Yeah, Mommy, we gotta move away. Well, good thing Jeffy doesn't have any more. I mean, we could make some. Yeah, Daddy, let's cook. No, no cooking illegal rock candy under this roof. But it's thousands of dollars. No buts, Marvin. <sighs> okay, Jeffy, let's go downstairs and cook breakfast. All right, Daddy. Okay, Jeffy, pour a little bit of the syrup on the pan. All right, Daddy. Yeah, that's looking real good. That's looking real good. Hey, Daddy, why are your eyes red? Oh, I'm allergic to latex. Oh, <laughs> why does it do that? It's allergic reaction, Jeffy. Look, let's check on the first batch. All right. Oh, that's looking good. Can we MF and cook or what? Yeah, Jeffy, it is looking really good. Oh, my God, we're amazing at this. What the hell are y'all doing in my kitchen? Wait, 
popping up dope up like a potty spaghetti. Oh, God, we can ruin our candy. That's just illegal. Oh, we really need the money. Oh, I'm about to call the police on y'all. Oh, we have a snitch, Jeff. Let's go get him. <laughs> 911. Yeah, yeah. Snitches get stitches. You should be. I thought you knew better. This candy dealer's in my kitchen. <laughs> Snitches. I got you, Daddy. I'll be right back. All right, I'm going to start putting the blue rock candy in the Ziploc bag. Marvin! Oh, oh no, Rose is coming. i got to hide this. Marvin, what are you cooking for breakfast? <gasps> Marvin, why are you dressed like that? Uh, me and Jeffy are making blue waffles. We Googled a picture of it to get the recipe. Ooh, that sounds yummy. Hey, Daddy, I got the fucker's head. <laughs> officer but i brought my good friend sebastian the no candy eating lion here to make you guys feel better sebastian get your ass in here <laughs> hey kids it's me sebastian the no candy lion <laughs> just say no to candy god damn it sebastian did you take a bump to the car just a little bump <laughs> just a little oh my god uh, sorry, sorry kids sebastian has to go back to the zoo what? no i don't want to go back there come on we're going back Guys, I can't believe Blue Rock Candy's illegal. I know, dude. I loved it. I would literally pay any amount of money just for one piece of it. I've literally never seen anybody eat Blue Rock Candy. I don't see what the big deal is. You guys want to buy some Blue Rock Candy? Oh, hell yeah. Here's $100. Here's $20. Oh, we're going to get for a dollar, dude. I want some. Well, since you guys are my boys, I'll give you guys half the bag for all your money put together. Here you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, bet. Oh, my God. This Blue Rock Candy's amazing. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's so delicious. Meh, it's okay. Hola, amigos. You want to buy some Blue Rock candy? Sorry, Felipe. We already bought some. Where did you get that from? Jeffy's selling it. Oh, let me try this shit. Woo! Shit's good. A little too good. My father needs to hear about this. Papi! All right, kids. Sebastian's in the car now. But as we were going to say, Blue Rock candy is illegal now because all that sugar causes early onset diabetes, schizophrenia, and teeth cancer, which is cancer of the teeth. Hey, you! What the hell is that? Kids? What? Penelope? Hi, Dad. Where did you get this Blue Rock candy from? Uh, it's Cody's. He bought most of it. Yeah, it's all Cody's. Where did you get it from? I ain't snitching. I'll die for my homies. Not talking, huh? Well, I guess you're coming with me down to the station. Fuck you. You pigs! I'll use my one phone call to call your mom! Wow, wow. Putting Cody on the bus like that, but Cody's a real one. I will say it was fully buddy. Another batch done. Alright, Danny, I sold half the bag at school and made 124 bucks. Jeffy, you goober! Half that bag alone is worth two grand! But they were my boys, so I had to hook them up! You don't have any boys in this industry, Jeffy. The only boys you got are dead presidents. Oh, like George Washington and Benjamin Franklin? Yeah, those are your boys. Alright, well, I promise I'll do better. But what happened was, I had to get them hooked, and once you get them hooked, then they come back and spend even more money. But, Jeffy, I need ten grand by tomorrow, so get your ass back out on that street and go door to door and sell more of this blue candy. Yes, sir. <sighs> Wasting my time cooking. <laughs> Who's that? Hello? Hey, yes, Oh, hey, amigo. I will have you your money by tomorrow. I sure will. Word on the street is that you've been cooking blue rock candy. Blue rock candy? I don't know how to make that stuff. Then why aren't you dressed like that, huh? I'm deep cleaning my kitchen. Don't lie to me, Holmes. I know you've been cooking it. Listen, I'm just trying to pay your money by tomorrow. You're stealing my operation and my customers. Well, I'm not trying to. But my son did bring me some of your stuff, and it was good. It was good? Yeah, so go in there and show me how you make it. Well, I'd rather keep it a secret. I Oh, okay, come on. Okay, look, this is how I make it. I put the sugar in the dye, then I put it on the pan, and I put it in the oven. I'll be taking this. Consider it a prepayment. Well, okay, look, I'm just trying to get you your $10,000 so I can be done. Forget about the $10,000. You work for me now. Work for you? For how long? Forever. Until the day you die. Well, what if I refuse? Then I'll just cut your eye out and cut your arm off. Well, are you at least going to pay me? Your payment is that you'll get to live. Listen, you just keep making this blue rock candy, and I'll be back later for more money. Oh my god, what did I get myself into? Uh, who's that? Hello? The cops! Hey there, Marvin. You deep 
cleaning? Uh, yeah, deep cleaning. What do you find officers want? Fine. You hear that, Simmons? He called us fine. Why are your eyes red? Oh, I got Windex in my eyes. Oh, I hate when that happens. Well, why would... I, I would say what actually happened. Well, you said you're allergic to, to latex. I'm pretty sure that would have been the reason. I'm pretty sure we could just said that. I'm pretty sure no one was found that suspicious, but whatever. Listen, Marvin, the reason I'm here is that I think I lost my favorite pen around your couch when I was telling you you had cancer. And you do still have cancer. You should probably get that taken care of. Oh, well, I just cleaned around my couch. I didn't see a pen. Oh, can I come in and look? Because it might be, like, under your couch. Well, I lifted up the couch. It's not under it. Oh, well, can I use your bathroom? Because I really got a tinkle. Well, I just cleaned the toilet, but I don't want you peeing all over the toilet seat. Oh, that's fair, because I do like to piss all over the seat. Hmm. Well, can I come in and have a drink? Because I'm pretty thirsty. Oh, I just poured out all the drinks in the refrigerator because they were expired. Wow, well, can I at least have some tap water? I have my my water turned off because I'm dying of cancer. I don't need water anymore. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that does make sense. Well, can I come in and look at your furniture? Because I'm furniture shopping and I want to show Simmons your couches. Okay, make it quick. Okay. See, Simmons, look at this couch. It's really nice. And I think it's a pullout, too. I never pull out of your mother. Ew, Simmons, ew! <laughs> Is that a woman screaming? No, no, no. I think that's just the TV. Something's wrong. Simmons, come on. No, 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 no. All right, Simmons, where did that woman scream come from? In here! I think it came from in here. Let's see. Oh my god! Well, they saw what it looks like! Look, I don't know what kind of weird kinky shit you guys are into, but I don't want to see it. No, he tied me up and banged me in the head! I, I, I don't need to know where he banged you, okay? I'm just gonna close the door. No, 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 no! Huh. Yep, so it's alright. Look, I'm really sorry for interrupting. I'll get out of your hair. Wait, Simmons, you smell that? Yeah, blue ass. I left a little rosebud in my kangaroo pouch. No, not that, Simmons. I smell blue rock candy. To the kitchen! Oh, no! Oh, my God, Simmons. We just walked in on a giant candy lab. Willie Walker would be proud. J just say it was Felipe's day. He's... Since we apparently were from now. We're going to jail for a million billion years. That's how illegal this is. No, I'm sorry. I just needed the money. Put your hands behind your back. Wait, wait is that a human head? That's murder. That's at least another hundred years. Yep. Yeah. Amigo, you saved me! Damn right I did now. Where's my money? Uh, money? I, well, I didn't sell anymore since you left. No, oh, it's not very much. Gracias, Pato. Now cut up these bodies and put them in acid. And you better have my money by the time I get back, or else. <laughs> oh, man, what am I gonna do? I, is he gone? I think so. Oh, God, that really hurt. I just didn't want him to kill us, so I used Ninja Focus to slow down my breathing and heart rate. Well, well you know I didn't do anything wrong. Like, he's making me do all this. Yeah, we heard the whole thing. I mean, it's not like you're doing this on your own. Uh, no, I never. Right, yeah, that's good. Okay, so I got a plan to kill that guy because nobody hits me with a bottle. Come on. Okay, so Simmons is standing guard outside that door in case the cartel guy comes back. When I give my dirt there! We'll get it in a minute. Hold on. Okay, so here's the plan. Whenever the cartel guy comes back to get his money, you're gonna tell him Tuna Fish Terry has his money, so he comes to see Tuna Fish Terry. Now, he hooked up a bunch of explosives inside that wheelchair, and they're connected to that bell. So whenever Tuna Fish Terry rings the bell, it'll blow up the wheelchair, killing both Tuna Fish Terry and the cartel guy. Well, when I give my dirt there! You'll get it when the cartel guy is dead! Jesus! He doesn't know he's gonna die. Why don't you just arrest the cartel member? Because that's lame. This is way cooler. I saw it in a TV show and I want to try it. He's coming! Oh, he's coming. I'll hide behind the couch. Uh, hey, SA, check out this book I got my kids. El Gato and Sombrerato. It's by this Dr. Sussman. He's crazy with the pictures. Check this shit out, man. This gato is crazy. He puts a cake on his head. My kids are going to love this shit, man. Oh, wow. Wait, you have kids? Oh, see. Si. Yeah, my kids would die without me. They love me so much. Especially since I'm the only thing they got because their mother died. Their mother died? Oh, yeah. I had to cut her head off because she didn't pay me my money. Speaking of, where's my money? Huh? Oh, huh? oh he, he has it. Okay. Where's my money? Uh, oh, oh, I think I just heard the oven go off. I, I have to get the candy out of the oven. Okay. Listen, I don't want to kill an old man, okay? What are you doing? Oh, I see. I see. Is a servant going to come and bring me my money? Oh, that was so cool. He was like, Pew! and then he was like, Ugh, I'm dead. Oh, that was way cooler than arresting people. But he had kids. Yeah, so what? You have kids. He was going to kill you. Yeah I, yeah, I didn't really feel bad for him the second he said he killed, killed the kid's mother. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to go downstairs and throw away all that blue rock candy. Just don't let me catch you with it ever again. You got it? Okay. Okay, so there's another thing. Uh, I've been looking at your lung x-ray, and you do not have lung cancer. That little black speck right there is actually a Skittle. If you look closely, you can actually see the S. See, I was eating Skittles when I took the x-ray, and I guess I just dropped one in there. So, yay, no cancer. Hey, Nelly, I sold Wicked Glass until I got your $10,000, so now you can pay the mortgage. Jimmy, you made $10,000 selling rock candy? Absolutely, Daddy. I move weight. These are my streets. Well, we don't even really need the $10,000 anymore because the mortgage guy's dead. Oh, shibby. Yeah, so 
Guess we don't have any problems. Hey, Daddy, how about we take these 10 Gs and go blow it at the arcade? Okay, Jenny, let's go! Woo! Let's do it. Um, Marvin? Jesse? Someone? Please get me out of here! <laughs> yeah, we'll wait. Yeah, we'll get you up when you finally give... When you finally let Marvin go in in the deep end. <laughs> if you know what I mean. <laughs> but anyway, that's my question. Where is your favorite candy? Starburst? Because them stuff is colorful. But anyway, people, what's your favorite candy? Make sure to comment it down below. And make sure, don't forget, people, to like and subscribe. Subscribe to me. Subscribe to SMO and the rest of the crew mentioned in the description. Subscribe to my friends' channels. Subscribe to my YouTube friends' channels. Subscribe to my other accounts. I'll see you guys in the next video. And I might be cooking up some blue rock cane myself. If you snitch on me, you're gonna die. Bye!